what's up lnc fam welcome back to another video rebuilding ferrari 458 part 2 if you guys haven't seen part 1 i'll put a link down in the description so you guys can check it out and be up to date us repairing the car and all the way to this point so in this video part 2 i'm gonna start the welding process i gotta weld the frame rails and then do minor body work and get this car over to the paint department so andre could do his magic so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and now let's get to work Just installed the bumper and everything lining up perfect. Gaps are perfect as well. Look at this. Woo! I like it a lot. Nothing sticking out. Everything is flush and ready to go. So now we could uh, remove the bumper and start welding the frame rails, the cage, and all that fun stuff and start doing the body work. Let's go. Okay, now we could take everything apart and weld everything. I even threw the frunk, make sure everything is good and the frunk is sitting properly. So right now, first things first, I'm gonna reinstall the rivets back into the original spots, like on this side. And then uh, once I'm done with rivets, then we'll start uh, welding the frame rail, the extension, and then the cage that holds the radiator. Now what I want to do, I want to remove the wheel so I have access to get to the side of the frame rail and do the same thing. I'll put three rivets and we'll start welding. And then I always put this pin because if you uh, drop the wheel by accident or it slips, you crack the rotor, guess what? It's going to cost you five grand. And we're trying to avoid making mistakes like that because that could be prevented. Especially working with exotics, cannot make any mistakes because if you do, it's gonna cost you a lot of money. That's it, just secured the frame rail with the uh, rivets exactly like this side. And then we'll do uh, welds at the bottom and then welds on the side. And that's it. We're gonna re weld everything right here at the bottom and then underneath and pretty much that's it up here and then we'll start welding the cage i got my aluminum welder all set up so we're ready to start welding so right now i'm gonna remove the bumper the headlight and we'll start welding and securing Just took everything apart, removed the headlights, so now we're ready to start welding. Let the fun begin, let's do this. Just finished with welding, so we're all done with the front end. Next, I gotta do minor repair on the passenger door and it's ready for paint. Just this corner got bent. So 
So right now I'll take the mirror part, this uh, molding and this plastic piece. And then we'll work on this corner, put a little bit of body filler and it's ready for paint. Just took the door apart. Next, I just gotta work on this edge a little bit. Pop it out, throw a little bit of body filler and it's ready to go. So right now I gotta heat this corner up a little bit and then we can start working. That's it, I'm finished with body work. My job is done for now. Time for Andre to do his magic and get this Ferrari painted. Let's go. Today's video, again, we're working on this beauty right here. Ferrari 458. Had a front end accident, everything was repaired, replaced, and we're ready to spray. We'll be spraying the passenger side door, fender, blending the hood as well as the driver's side fender and of course our brand new bumper once again i'll be using my cigar 4600 digital it's a 1.3 aqua cap and it's gonna be sprayed at 20 psi Check out this paint job. Andre killed it once again. Came out beautiful like nothing happened. If you guys want to see step-by-step -step painting process, check out my brother's YouTube channel, LMC Painter. I'll put all his information down in the description and you guys can see the whole process. So for now, we're going to end the video here. Stay tuned for part three. and part three, we'll start putting the car back together. Pretty much get this car ready for wash, detail and delivery. Once again, big thank you to you guys for watching this video. If you guys are new to this channel and you guys enjoy this kind of content, you know what to do. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in part three. Do you